volume of a cone word problems. If you're having problems understanding volume, go back to my video number 35. That's the intro to volume video. And then these will help you because it'll show you volume of a rectangular uh, solid and things like that. So, the first thing we want to do is draw a diagram of the problem to help you visualize it, okay? So, here's our problem, and I drew a diagram to go with it. A pile of gravel is in the shape of a cone. If the pile is 8 feet high and the diameter of the pile is 10 feet, that's from side to side, how many cubic feet of gravel are in the pile? Well, remember, we need to do the radius squared. Volume equals one-third times the radius times uh, uh, pi, I'm sorry, times radius squared times the height. So if we need radius, we have to remember that the radius is half the diameter. So if they give you the diameter, just cut it in half. If it's 10, now we need to use 5 as the radius. Okay? So now we're going to do the radius part first, and we're going to do 5 times 5. Okay? And then the height is 8. So we get 5 times 5, and then that times 8. So we get 25 times 8. Well, 4 25s is 100, like 4 quarters or a dollar. So 8 of them is like 200, like $2, okay? So now we need to multiply the 1 third times the pi, 3.14, times the 200. So here's the 3.14 times 200. It comes out to 628, all right? And because there was two decimal points in the 3.14, I moved it over in the answer, so that took the zeros off, so we only have 628. Now we need to divide that by 3, Okay, 628 divided by 3 comes out to 209.3. And that's our volume of the pile of gravel. 209.3 cubic feet, because it's dealing with feet. That is the label that we would put on it. Okay, so now for a little fun. Emma doesn't like broccoli. And for three years, whenever her mother gives her broccoli for dinner, she throws it out the back window. Now the pile is 7 meters high with a 6 meter radius. How many cubic meters of broccoli has she wasted? My goodness. So we take the 3 years is not important, so that's just there to confuse you. All you need is the 7 meters high and the 6 meter radius. See? So we plug that into our uh, formula and the radius is 6, so we do 6 times 6 for the radius squared here. 6 times 6 is 36. We need to multiply that by 7. Here we go, right here. It's 252. Now we're going to multiply that by the pi, 3.14. 252 times pi, 3.14. With all the math comes down to 791.28. Now that needs to be multiplied by a third, or the opposite of multiplication is division. We could divide this number by 3, and I did. And I came up with 263.76 cubic meters. Eat your broccoli. I hope this helped. You can watch my videos again and pass them along to anyone you think needs help in algebra or geometry or fractions or percentages or any of my other videos. Uh, don't forget to subscribe or to hit the like button if you like my videos. And we are going to continue on in geometry. And I'll see you next time.